Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to write protect or lock your flash drives uh, using a free app called NTFS Drive Protection. Now one thing to keep in mind is that your flash drive has to be formatted NTFS for this to work because it uses that to uh, help lock it up. Alright, so once you download the program here, it's a free uh, download, just a zip file, then you just extract it and you'll run the executable. And then just make sure you pick your right, the right flash drive from the drop-down if you have more than one here. So by default, you can make an uh, unprotected folder if you want, if this box is checked here. So when you start protection, it'll create this folder and leave it uh, unlocked so you can still use it to uh, you know, add files and change files and that kind of thing. So once you pick your drive, you can see right now it's uh, not right protected. You just pick Start Protection. So if I go to this drive here, refresh it here. So here's that folder it made that's unprotected. So right now, if I were to try and delete this, won't let me do it. If I try and make a new uh, file here. Won't let me do it, but if I go to my unprotected folder, try to make a new file, works just fine. So pretty basic, and if you want to add a custom folder, so I have this uh, unlocked one here, so I could go in here, type in the name. Now I just need to check the box here to apply on drive. So now if I go back to the drive here, I have my unlocked folder. If I try to make a new file here. Works. I try and delete one here. Works like that. So just be sure when you make a file, just type in the name and check the box here. And then you could also uh, add to list or delete from list, that type of thing too. And then you could reset permissions on the uh, files if you want to do that as well. And then if you're done, uh, you want to just stop it, just click on this. And now it's not right protected. And now you could go back in. Go back here. Let's say you want to delete one of these. Make a new file, just like that. All right, so I will put a link in the description for this. You could uh, download it and try it out for yourself. You know, just keep the program handy in case you lock your drive and you want to go back and unlock it easily. Otherwise, you'll have to go through it manually to uh, unlock all your files and that kind of thing. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.